The business platform of the German-Brazilian Chamber presents Santa Catarina, holding hands with the future. Being on top of the Brazilian Human Development Index, Santa Catarina stands out as a modern state with a strong economy, founded by hard-working and welcoming people. It's the perfect destination for companies looking for sustainable broad-based growth. Located in the south of Brazil, you will find the state lying between Sao Paulo and Buenos Aires, two of the biggest industrial hubs of the continent, and connected by only two-hour flight to the capitals of the neighboring Mercosur countries. The state embraces 293 cities and almost six and a half million inhabitants. The tourism in Santa Catarina generates almost five billion dollars and moves around 21 million people each year. People who are striving after the inherited traditions of European immigrants and natural beauties. One third of all of the Atlantic forest lies in Santa Catarina. Here the environmental preservation goes side by side with prosperity and social development. Santa Catarina holds the country's highest industrial GDP per capita. And here you will find Brazil's highest life expectancy. 27 of the top 100 Brazilian cities regarding the Human Development Index belong to Santa Catarina. Government indicators showing education, health and youth income view Santa Catarina's second place in Brazil. All economic sectors are balanced and Santa Catarina is the state with the most equitable income distribution among Brazil's leading states. The service sector, with over 74,000 companies, accounts for the greatest number of employees. Santa Catarina is the fourth most successful job creating state in Brazil. Likewise, the manufacturing industry is the fourth biggest in the country. And here a lot is produced. Santa Catarina is the biggest Brazilian producer of pork, apples, onions, oysters, and mussels, and the second biggest producer of rice, tobacco, poultry, and honey. All this in a state that covers just over 1% of the Brazilian territory, representing only 3% of Brazil's population. But the big comparative advantage of Santa Catarina lies in its development model. Built on economically evenly distributed regional centers, Santa Catarina is an economy characterized through diversification. Santa Catarina is Brazil's leading producer of pork and the second biggest poultry producer in Brazil. Its agribusinesses comprises more than 3,000 industries employing 100,000 people. The cities Chapico, Concordia, and Videra concentrate the greatest part of the food production of the state. The agribusinesses stands for 39% of the state's exports. Roughly 3 billion are exported each year. Santa Canarina's electronic metal and mechanic processing industry is located in the cities of Joinville and Jaraguá do Sul. This cluster covers 5,500 industries which employ over 135,000 people. Industry exports reach annually almost two billion and account for 25 percent of Santa Canarina's international trade. The wood industry and its surroundings as furniture production and cellulose industry is the biggest of its kind in Latin America, employing 85,000 workmen and exporting 850 million each year. With more than 9,000 companies and 172,000 employees, you will find the highest textile industry concentration of Latin America in Santa Catarina. 
exporting products worth more than $190 million. Santa Canarina is Brazil's largest crude coal producer. Besides, it is the national leader in producing and second in exporting ceramic coverings. The annually ceramics exports count for 125 million. More than 1,600 Santa Canarina companies are operating in the information technology sector. A yearly output of over 1 billion and 45,000 employees makes Santa Canarina the national leader in engineering, business and textile specific software. With a coastline of 500 kilometers, the state is the greatest national fish producer, accounting for more than 16% of total Brazilian production. By the size of employment, Santa Canarina's shipping industry is already the third biggest in the country. Thanks to its natural beauty and cultural diversity, Santa Canarina welcomes more than 21 million tourists each year. Under the most attracting cities, you find Florinopolis, also known as Brazil's third best foreign tourist destination. Boniaru Kumbaru, Blumenau, and Joivile. The hotel industry alone generates 220,000 direct and indirect jobs. The annual tourism turnover is around 5 billion. And to give you mobility, Santa Canarina provides you with several options for transport. There are five well-equipped harbors, modern highways to the surrounding regions, and three airports capable of handling large commercial aircrafts. Open ways for even greater development. With 70 advanced colleges and universities, and over 100 professional training centers, Santa Canarina represents a Brazilian model for education. Here, 95% of the people over 15 years of age are literate. The state has a fully developed network of electric power supply. The natural gas system, with an extension of more than 500 kilometers, is the third biggest in the country. All villages and cities of Santa Canarina are connected through landline phones. You will find mobile phone coverage and easy access to broadband internet in almost the entire state. The state offers access to high standard medicine with over 11,000 health units and about 15,000 hospital beds. The state is also known reference for organ transplants. Naturally, Santa Canarina offers a solid banking infrastructure that provides capital and special credit lines easing the access for Santa Canarina companies to enter regional and global markets. Santa Canarina, holding hands with the future so you can embrace the whole world.